Thanks, everybody, for coming. Uh, you've brought out the sunshine. The barometer's up, and you're ready to spend some money. I'm happy to hear, see that. <laughs> this past spring, Hall of Fame coach Bud Grant celebrated his 88th birthday, not by receiving things, but by opening up his garage and selling them instead. Well, since I retired, I gotta do something. Now you think I'm a goose, but I can see you, but you can't see me. Well, after living in the same house for all these, you know, 40 some years, you know, you acquire, if you live to be as long as I do, you acquire a lot of stuff. From his playing days at the University of Minnesota to his 18 years as head coach of the Minnesota Vikings, the sale encompassed a life's worth of rare treasures, some football related, some not. I bet you don't have a catfish trap. Well, there's one right there. Homemade with white oak, comes out of Iowa, $200. You know, everything from knickknacks to duck decoys. You make that yourself? Yeah. Well, then I got to, the way I see it, I got a heck of a deal on this. Yeah. And then Viking stuff, of course, he's got loads of that because, you know, he's had it for years and he's been going in the back and he goes, I keep finding stuff in the closet. Thanks for coming. I mean, Bud's selling everything, including uh, the sweater that he's wearing when Steve Sable interviewed him in 1969, right here in his front yard, riding around in a Skidoo snowmobile. Should I go and let the dogs out now, or do you want to do that later? Well, let's just do one more ride, Coach. OK. There's a history behind a lot of things that you use and sell. It's interesting to talk to people about what they find valuable. Happy birthday, Coach. Hey. You I've know heard what? this is your first gun. That's my first gun. It is. Yeah. I bought his wife's rocking chair last year. Now I can watch the Vikings skiing in his grandmother's rocking chair. Yeah, I imagine that Bud probably skied in these to the stadium in the early days. And I think because he's been such an icon in the state that they want to see him, they want to meet him. We drove down here, two and a half hour drive. Now we got a Vikings fish. A chance to come and buy something from him at his house means something more than anything that they could buy anywhere else.